Well, hello, friends and family. It is Saturday, and we are here at the newly renovated, recently unrenovated, soon to be unrenovated again, Beaver Dam. So, this is uh, the lower pond at our place, and I uh, thought we'd give you a peek here, see how they build these things. You can see we got a lot of mud, a lot of sticks. We got some big sticks down here in the hole. A couple long ones. Those don't look like they did it a whole lot. Oh, a couple, three of them. Of course, we're going to be taking trophies today. Or you will find a walking stick from that pile over there, maybe. So we're going to try to... Uh, Loosen this guy up and see if we can get uh, it to drain out. This right here, hopefully you can see into the water there. This, I think, is where they dug the mud up. There and maybe down over in here. They dug the mud and the grass and stuff up. And they shove it right up against their sticks. They stick their sticks in sideways. And here we go. Sideways. Look at that guy. <laughs> That's awesome. So, I think we're going to uh, do a little reconstruction here and uh, we'll come back and see how it goes. Here we are again. As you can see, the dam has been removed and the water is going down. So we're going to chalk that up as a win for us today. And uh, I guess we're going to go take a look and see what happened upstream and uh, we'll do a little bit of walkabout later and see what we can see. And if you don't see us again, uh, don't try this at home, kids and stay out of trouble. Well, we were hanging out here and watching the water go down. See, it's gone quite a bit down. And I decided to come over here because it looked like there was a space underneath that tree. And then I came over here and I started looking down here. I noticed that there were pathways down there. So, we start looking and lo and behold, see the pathway down there? Goes up over there. And I'm pretty sure that turns to the right in there and it pops out down there. And then that hole right here goes down through there and pops out way down there. Like down, down there, down there and also right there where you can see the holes so when they want to climb from up here to down there they'll uh, probably come down here and just scoot through this hole and uh, around there instead of trying to swim or crawl so yeah interesting uh they seem to like left turns it seems like most of the stuff i've run into they make a they make a hole and immediately turn left. Maybe that's just uh, happens to be the ones I've run into. All right, we're gonna take a walk across the pond. We're gonna go have a look at that uh, upper pond that I opened up, uh, geez, I wanna say about a month ago. Last time I went up there, uh, nothing had been done to it, so I'm Guessing that when I go up there, uh, nothing is probably still done to it, but maybe not. Uh, certainly looks like down the way here, they just rebuilt that dam right where I removed it from. And uh, they keep having to go a little bit further to get the mud and the grass to build their dam with. Maybe eventually they'll get tired of building it or they'll try somewhere else. Maybe I'll just keep working at it. I see Marcy down there working at the dam. 
I'm probably just getting chunks of mud out. So see all these lighter colored sticks. These are all these are all pretty pretty new. Ooh! Hey, that's a nice nice walking stick right there. We're gonna keep that. Oh, he's gotta take a trophy. Ooh, that might be a nice one too. Oh, that's a little one. Pretty fresh though. All right. Well, let's uh, let's see if we can get across here safely. Wow. Well, so you can see how low the pond is. Uh, this was just about overflowing last time. Look at that. That almost looks like a little ladder. Pretty cool. Alright, let's uh, get across here. Look at all this old wood. Stick right there too. I'm not sure I'm coming across this way again. Boy, they got some good walking sticks on this one. There's another one. <laughs> I feel like the beavers that don't eat these whole things are the older ones that are getting a little more lazy. That could be my imagination me wanting to give them human characteristics you can see this is a looks like a beaver poop down there we'll go have a look either that or it's a rock that's a rock you can see, look at this path. Right down into the water. Alright, well, let's continue our journey. We just came down for the day, so unfortunately we're not going to be able to find out if the beavers rebuilt overnight or not, although I'd imagine they probably did, or do, or will, however that is. So, yeah, you can see they come right through here. Well, let's go see what we got going on here. It's nice being able to walk over here to the other side of our property. For, <laughs> I want to say for the first six months we were here, this is kind of a mystery. Everything, everything on this side was a mystery. <sighs> well, let's see. Yeah, they were through here last time we saw all of that I guess like they marked their trails all right let's go let's go have a look it's a little ways up there yep still running no dams built here although that's interesting, the grass is growing there. So, not, uh, not too big of a deal. Okay, we're gonna 
Let me show you something here. This is at the base of the tree, uh, down here at the edge of the pond, uh, right here, all the way around. Hopefully the camera will catch this. Down here, there's uh, basically a cave system. You can see back in there. It goes all the way around. Goes back over here. Let's see if we can set the camera down. Look back in there. camera can see I'm looking but this whole hillside here whoa is just dug out all the way around you see that big gap there and I'm pretty sure sorry folks I'm kind of operating 50% digits here so let's see if we can see that whoa down here Uh, yeah, right underneath the water here. Pretty sure that the, it keeps going. Lots of fresh sticks too. But, uh, up above there. Oh boy, I'm not sure what the heck I did here.